Hello. Hey, Jeff, it's Sal. Yeah. So we have this woman. She's from Wuhan, China, and she's willing to vomit on you. Yeah, yeah. She has a fever. She's a little clammy, and she suffers from nausea, so she would have no uh, problem throwing up on you. Is that cool? I'd be taking a very bad, very big risk. Uh, uh, Gorgeous girl. I don't, uh, that's, uh, I don't know if that would be... Uh, and her puke is, like, really hot and thick. Uh, yeah, I maybe I'm willing. Yeah, maybe say I'm, say I'm willing. Okay, full disclosure, she does have corona. Is that okay? Yeah. So she has the coronavirus, and you would let her vomit on you? I would. Okay. Mm -hmm. But you have to be quarantined for 14 days after she pukes on you. Quarantine where? Where? In my house? Where? I'm not sure. It could be a house or a medical facility. Is that okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now, there's one more thing I have to tell you. Right. She happens to be a man. I mean, she, she identifies as a woman, but she still has a penis. But she, no, she's a no, gorgeous I, woman. I always know. Biological females only. I'm not... not uh, I'll have to pass. I'm sorry. She's hot. Who cares if she's a man? That's a, 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 That would definitely be a buzzkill. Well, what if we, like, taped up her penis to the back of her butt area and you wouldn't no be man. able to see... No man, biological female only. Have a nice day.